Hello, my friends. Kevin Okwana here. How is everyone doing tonight? I'd like to welcome you to this Infinii Corporate Update webinar. Hop in the chat. Let me know how you guys are doing. See how, what is everyone is up to. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. How are we doing, David? Marin, good to see you here. Bob, Mark, Gary. Good, good, good. Beautiful, beautiful. So I know we're starting a couple minutes late, so we're going to get right into it. We've got Hitesh Chaneja on with us, the CEO of Infinii. So he'll be here with us helping us rock this thing out and, and there we got some updates we want to go through some of you will have noticed some things that we uh, sent out in the last email if you guys got that um, a couple things we want to kind of touch on is what is happening with our uh, listing service and the tools and, and the tracking systems you guys are rocking it out if you guys can see this screen let me know hop in the chat and say i see you and what you'll what you're going to see here is just a staggering a staggering amount of growth that we've had in the use of our tools and our software in the last 40 some odd days. Look at June, and I, I keep sending this out and I'll probably keep sending it out because it is ridiculous. We went from just around 1 million uh, listings and utilization of our system up to all the way 17.5. Do you guys realize what kind of growth that is? That is insanity. And so it's, it's all you guys. It's you guys using the tracking software. It's you guys building your business. It's you guys making profits and everything you're doing. And we're, we cannot, cannot express how proud we are of what you guys are accomplishing right now because we can see these numbers and we can see in real time what you're doing. And so it's very, very exciting to see this. And uh, we just appreciate that you guys are changing your lives and doing everything you need to do on the e-commerce side. So who's been using the tracking software? Who's been using all the tools and the training uh, in, in doing this? Who's, who's actually participating in this to send us to 17.5 uh, million so far this month, <laughs> so far this month in listings. You guys are awesome. You know, I wish I could just uh, come shake all your hands because it's amazing. And now uh, we, we really appreciate all the hard work and effort you guys are putting into everything. And on top of this, we got some some cool stuff for you. So those of you who are partners here with Infinii, you'll notice that we have a new genealogy display. If you go into your back office and you toggle partners and then you go to your genealogy, you'll see this. And I've got some things blurred out, but I wanted to cover just a little bit on this to show you um, what you can do here. So you can also access the legacy display. OK, so for those of you who like the old genealogy, go ahead and you can still access it for now. You can just click on view your legacy genealogy and you'll see the old one. But this genealogy, what it enables you to do is change your uplines without the 30 day cap. You know, we all had 30 days when somebody came in to Infinii at 30 days to move them. Now you can move them whenever you want to. And it looks something like this. You can move them one time um, and that 30 day restriction is not there anymore. So we're pretty excited about that to give you guys the time you need to get the growth that you need in your organizations. If you want to dig into someone's genealogy, you just click on their genealogy tab and it'll toggle open and you can look into their genealogy and dig deeper to help them build. Now, for those of you who, have, who are building this on the partner side, um, and there's a there's a video that explains this on the page as well. But for those of you who are building on the partner side, is this not a better genealogy display than the old one that we had in there? Which one do you guys like better? Toss it in the chat and let me know. Love your feedback on this. Awesome, awesome, beautiful, beautiful. So the next thing I want to get into is I want to recognize some folks because. We have a lot of people that are rocking it out that are coming in here and, and just uh, just making things happen. And so right here are our top recruiters over the last seven days. These are just the last seven days. Um, but um, I wanted to make sure that you guys knew and could see who these people are because they are out there, the ones that are building, right? A lot of times in, in companies, um, it's, it's hard to know who's making the moves and who's getting stuff done. And so what we're gonna start doing is putting a leaderboard here very soon in the back office to where you guys can watch that. Um, but just my my hats off to you guys, right? William, uh, Reginald, Keisha, Alejandro, uh, ELM Marketing, uh, Rocio, you're awesome. Louise, Paul, I mean, all of you are doing amazing things. Brian Bremer's on here. I think you guys all know who he is. Uh, Darshella, uh, Ajay, Deborah, Christos, uh, Jose, Penguin Enterprises, all right? It's just, it's 
it's cool to see people rising to the top and helping each other out and really bringing people on board into Infinii. So this is the top recruiters over the last seven days. And uh, it's very important that we uh, we just get our hats goes off to these guys because they're building this thing, right? They're building this and they're growing and they're helping people grow. So congratulations, you guys. We really appreciate you. Um, we're going to start sending out some more recognition because we have so many amazing people rocking this thing out. Uh, and you guys are kind of rising to the top with how many people you're bringing in and introducing to this platform and this amazing community of people that are helping folks build. So awesome stuff. Uh, the next thing I want to get into is the event. Um, as you guys know, we had an event scheduled for Dallas. And if you were on the last webinar, and let me know if you were on the last webinar and heard all the details of this, but I just want to cover it one more time so we're all on the same page. We were, what we were going to do is we were going to have a live event in Dallas. Awesome. Thanks, Steve. Lily. Deborah, beautiful, beautiful. So we were going to have a live event in Dallas. And now what we're doing is we're doing an online event workshop. And we're actually donating the profits to Chalk and Band of Parents. Um, for those of you who aren't fully familiar with these organizations, they are doing a huge world of good out there to help fight cancer. And uh, we want to support them 100%. So what we're doing is we're actually going to do an online workshop, an online event, where we're going to be donating all of the profits to those organizations. And, uh, you know, so this is just something we're, we're really, we've always been looking forward to do. And now we have the opportunity to do that as we had, we were in a position where we had to cancel the, uh, the event in Dallas. And these organizations, you guys can look them up. Uh, just go to chalk.org and you can find it. Google uh, Band of Parents and you guys can check these organizations out and see what they're really doing uh, to help people. But we think these are amazing causes. We have very personal relationships. Um, Hitesh does. Uh, that he's, he's you know been involved with these organizations and we're really looking to take our efforts and helping them to the next level. So this is what we're doing. Now, this online event workshop is going to, um, is not going to start the same day we were going to have the event in Dallas. It's actually going to start on September 25th. So any of you who are interested in doing that, you'll be getting an email on this. Um, we'll be sending out more details, but I want to give you kind of a rough idea of what to expect in this online workshop. And that is going to be on the, 27, on the 25th, we're going to start it out with an e-commerce uh, uh, bootcamp training where we get into eBay and we get into Amazon. Start digging into accounts and show you guys what's working, what's not, and give you some overall advanced methods. And we'll be pulling from multiple trainers. Right? We have so many trainers in here and so many different aspects of how they look at growing eBay and how they look at growing Amazon that you guys get to leverage those folks. And yes, this will be recorded for those of you who can't show up at these times. We understand that not everyone will be able to make it, but a lot of people will be, want to um will want to get these recordings. So if you have a ticket, you will be able to get the recordings. On the 26th, we're going to get into self-managed platforms. And then we're going to move on into Bonanza. All right, self-managed platforms and Bonanza. Those are things like Shopify. And there's a couple others that we have yet to talk about that we really want to start bringing to the forefront of, um, of you know, the training that we do here because it's really great for national folks that are in the U.S. and it's really great for people that are international. And so you'll learn more about that on the 26th and you'll get to get into Bonanza and dig into that on the 26th as well. Um, for those of you who are here selling on Bonanza, who's rocking that out? Just let me know in the chat if you guys are rocking out Bonanza. Awesome, awesome. We have some really cool tools out there for you guys to use in Bonanza. We'll start mastering that with you, teaching you guys how to leverage that even more. So definitely be at these um, at this uh, online event. Uh, we're also going to get into leverage growth section on the 27th. So on the 27th is going to be a lot about um, the partner side, okay, the partner side and leveraging, leveraging your business. And um, John Kinnear, who you guys should all be familiar with, um, has built some amazing organizations and, and helped so many people. Uh, and he's going to be bringing his knowledge uh, to teach you guys on what you need to do to have a successful team. And then I'm going to chime in at 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on the 27th, where I'm going to walk you guys through some online campaigns. You might have seen, if you're in one of our Facebook groups, <laughs> you might have seen where I put in like like 50 some odd people into Infinii in, in I think it's like four days or something. So I'm going to walk you guys through those campaigns and what I did to do that. Um, it was very much so something that I knew was going to happen, right? I knew this was going to happen. Um, it wasn't a surprise to me. I really just went to a campaign, hit unpause, and let the campaigns run. So I'm going to walk you guys through what I did to do that. 
uh, pretty much on demand. We'll get into that. So for those of you who are building the um, the partner side, or even if you're, you know, no matter what you're selling, um, this will be able to help you out because generating, being able to generate traffic to your business is the core fundamental purpose um, of any company, right? If you don't have traffic, you don't have a business. No, I don't care what you're selling. I don't care if you're selling screen skincare. I don't care if you're promoting a network marketing company. I don't care if you're selling coffee mugs that have cute cats on them. It doesn't matter. You still need eyeballs on your websites that's targeted. And so we're going to teach you how to do that um, in a very, the, one of the ways that I do it. Um, and then I don't have any expectations that we'll be able to cover everything in, in just three days. So we're actually going to do some on-course sessions. We'll see where you guys are at with your e-commerce, we'll see where you guys are at with your questions, we'll see where you guys are at with this um, with this uh, online event, and then we'll, we'll do a, an, on, an uh, encore session or two, so you guys can uh, really get your questions answered and, and maybe even see some campaigns play out that we might kick off on that webinar, on those trainings. So I'm pretty excited about all that. I think it's gonna be uh, pretty amazing you know, you, you guys don't have to fly anywhere. You can just, you know, be there. We can do this. We can donate to some amazing organizations, right? And make sure that they that they get uh, more desperately needed income to help them uh, start, you know, heal, heal children across the world. So we're pretty excited about all of this. What do you guys think of all of that so far? Hop in the chat. Let me know. Um, you cannot get the tickets yet. Um, you cannot purchase them yet. We will send you guys out an email letting you know. Uh, pretty awesome. Thank you. Thank you, Paul. You know, beautiful. Mark, Leah, Steve, Robert, Richard, you guys are awesome. So this is um, this is going to be something that I think um, is it's just going to be better, right? I mean, we all have that need to um, to help people. And you'll always find, every single one of you, everybody finds that once you hit a certain level of success, it's, it's no longer about uh, generating an income or getting assets. It becomes, how can I help other people? people really want to start making an impact on the world um, and, and shame on us for not doing it um, as much as we could earlier, right? So we're very excited about this, very excited about this. So with that, I want to, uh, if Hitesh is on and see if you got any any words you'd like to, to toss out here, Hitesh, anything you want to go over with everybody um, that, uh, that they need to hear from you. So we'll go ahead if you're there. We Hop on over here and see if Hitesh is on. I believe he is. Hey, Tesh, are you still with us, my friend? All right, we might have lost him. So going back to this, let me hop in the chat and see if you guys have any questions on this while we wait for him to pop on out. Let me know if you guys have any questions on any of this stuff. And it sounds like there he is. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm here. I'm here. Okay. <laughs> All right. So is there anything, um, is there anything else that you'd like to cover on this? I know um, we have a lot of things going on on the, on the e-com side, uh, a lot of new stuff on the tracking. Is there anything that you want to, you want to cover with everybody? Yeah, there's actually a few things that I wanted to go over. Um, the first thing is really the overall direction of where we're moving on the e-commerce stuff. So if I can take the screen for just a moment. So, there are, there are quite a few things that we've been building and we've been doing. I think you guys already saw there's a new Amazon tracking system that um, I think some of you already saw in the last webinar, but you can go into your Amazon settings page in your back office, start connecting that in there, and a few other things like that. Um, but I really want to talk about the overall direction where things are kind of headed and some stuff that I'm not going to mention yet, but it's been very exciting today. Um, so essentially, the entire e-commerce world, if you actually look at the way Amazon is treating its customers, the way Alibaba does things, the way eBay does things, it's all being transformed towards what we call a standard sales funnel. And the faster you all turn your business towards that, the better you will do. So to give you an example, um, earlier the idea was put out listings, put out as many listings as possible, and then try to maximize them as it becomes more and more easy for people to just go out there and start creating listings. It kind of becomes a competition to see who has the best fun, right? So we, we're all aware of this. You need to find the right products. You need to start putting them out there. But then also, what do you do in that entire process? So the standard sales funnel basically goes something like this. Uh, you have the sales page. 
and then you have customer follow-up and then you have a secondary thing which is follow up with customers who have not purchased yet right so then you have follow up with non buyers which then makes them a customer and then basically have what we call a promotion of some sort to get them back to some other sales page okay so this is a standard sales funnel this is what everything out there in the world uses offline businesses online businesses whether they know it or not whether they are trying to do it or not this is what everybody out there is doing or has to do at some point to be actually significantly successful and obviously a big benefit here is that with a few sales only you can actually get really really strong results and you can start developing a very large business now the problem is that most people who are doing e-commerce are simply sticking to this piece and that's it they go out there they create their listings and that's where it begins and ends and what we want to start helping them do is transition over to everything else so the first piece we did which we were kind of one of the first people to do was set up automated follow ups for people where they can start buying other things right that's what supremacy tool does that's in your search membership now what we are trying to do instead is you will see this release over the next 2 to 3 weeks and especially you know just just a, just the general trend overall is that we want to move towards incorporating more tools where all of this can happen on so we have a new feedback management system that's actually within your back office so when there are sales that get made on ebay it can automatically go ahead and leave feedback for those users and then after a few more minutes or a few hours or a few days however you want to set it it will automatically also go ahead message them with hey i just put my uh, store on sale you had purchased x product from us in the past we believe you would be very interested in this product as well and get them back there for you so what we do with that is what we call essentially chains okay so niche product chain is identification or understanding intelligently of a user bought product x so he is more likely also to purchase product y okay so if somebody had purchased a bike tire inflator they might also be interested in buying a bike handlebar fixing thing or they might be interested in buying a new seat cover that's more comfortable to ride with or they might be interested in something to if it was a sports bike or a racing bike they might be interested in some accessories for that so this is where this becomes very interesting because you're able to now plug in one item and say here is an item that i'm currently selling that's that i'm selling well so you identify a product that's doing well for you you enter that into the system and the system then goes out and finds and creates basically a chain of this user is probably also interested in these other eight or nine things and then you can start following up with all, all of the users on autopilot getting them to purchase these other items off of your ebay store off of your amazon store and this is where it becomes more powerful is even getting them off of there and maybe onto your self managed stores and that's one of the pieces that kevin really wanted to uh, discuss with you guys now all of the stuff is what you really will need over time to become more aggressive in what your what we basically call earnings per visitor how that plays out for you so earnings per visitor is how much do you make for each person who comes to your ebay listing or amazon listing now the interesting thing is this is what these companies use when they are ranking listings themselves so you'll see sometimes where amazon is ranking these particular listings really high and you can't figure out why you're trying to figure out is it because of the number of reviews is it because of the type of reviews is it because of the external traffic and we've gone through that do um how many here know how the external traffic metric works for amazon for your ranking if you're not aware of that if there are enough requests maybe i'll discover that right now but if you all are familiar then let's just move on to the epv stuff but basically the way epv works is amazon is looking at all the listings saying which listings are producing in a particular niche which listings all things being equal are producing the highest amount of earnings for our company what is producing the highest amounts of sale how much dollar per visitor which listing is producing that the most for us and it will automatically start ranking those particular listings higher than others so that's one of the things you really want to do you want to be that particular listing that drives the highest amount of ev epv 
Okay, so that's a very key thing. And this whole structure that we're going towards, the whole system that we are working towards is essentially designed to do that. So a lot of the things and a lot of the trainings that you're going to see on this online event that we're holding starting September 25th, you're going to see a lot of discussions about how to maximize your EPV. That's not only good for you immediately because that's making you a lot more money. It's also very good for you because it's helping boost your ranking. So that as a side effect, you're going to end up making a lot more sales as well. So it's a very interesting piece and that's kind of what we've been working towards. And it's, it's coming together very nicely. I mean, I'm getting excited about releasing this to all of you. Meanwhile, how many of you have so far connected your Amazon accounts into the Infinia system? If you have done so, just say yes. Okay, so we have a few, and then we have a few saying not yet. Okay, if you haven't yet, all you have to do is go in your back office, go under tools, and there's Amazon settings. Okay, so just go under tools, and then Amazon settings, and connect your Amazon account in there, and from that moment on, we can actually start working on your Amazon listings as well. Once you have done so and confirmed that your Amazon account is in there, you will have the ability to essentially define a source of your Amazon products just like you do for your eBay products. And that's how it's going to start uh, tracking your Amazon items as well. So if you have items on Amazon, it'll track those in your listings and so on. Um, And if you don't have items uh, that you, if you don't know where you're sourcing your items from, you might actually just be doing FBA, for example. For FBA users, we already have an FBA repricing system and an FBA tracking system. So that's back there for you as well. So again, you do want to connect your Amazon settings, even if you're doing FBA. In fact, that's kind of what you know we lean towards. We want you guys to do more FBA because there's a bit more money in there in some ways. So you want to do uh, the Amazon settings connection this will allow you to track your items on Amazon side, just like you track your items on eBay side. And then we're going to work out one for Bonanza as well. That works about the same way, uh, depending on the demand, right? If we see a lot, a lot more demand for it, then we speed that up in our queue. So these are some of the cool things that are happening in the background and, and what's been happening and going on. And one thing that we have been always excited about doing is because of our size and the user base that we have and so on, we're able to apply this whole methodology right here, this piece, we are able to apply that in many other areas and start you know, giving it to our users and providing it for our users in a bigger way. So one thing that you're going to see that Kevin didn't mention that's probably going to happen in an encore fashion is we've been creating, not just been creating, but we actually did create an entire system that does this. Um, and it's not necessarily just for e-commerce, it's actually for everything out there. And we built that system out and we've been running some tests with it and it's really insane uh, what you're able to do once you have all the deep analytics on what's working for you, what's not working for you, where the traffic should be coming from and how to create profitable, you know, pos positive ROI campaigns for yourself. So that's another big piece that we've been working on and hopefully we'll actually show you guys exactly what we did with it and how you can replicate that for yourself if you would like, even outside of just the e-commerce space. So instead of just creating listings on eBay and working with that. Here's how you do that also outside of eBay, maybe on your own web pages, or here's how you do that on other platforms as well. So all of these really cool things are gonna be coming out on the, uh, at the time of the event, when we guys, when we actually get to interact with you there. Um, I see a couple of questions about when we are going to be putting out the checkout for it. So we're going to be actually putting together a checkout for that online event. We're gonna send the details for you guys. Uh, and on the next week webinar. And at the time, you will see all the details on what's going to be covered, just like Kevin covered just now. You're going to have a little list on there, so you'll be able to see all the different pieces for that particular event. Okay. And how do I get started as a new person? What would be the main thing to begin with? So the first thing you want to do is go into your back office and go to Prime, start with the training, and then go to your tools, Go to eBay settings and connect your eBay account. Go to Amazon settings, connect your Amazon account. And now basically the training is gonna show you how you can take these tools and start creating listings on eBay, sourcing your products from somewhere else at a profit, and then just sell them at a nice profit margin. Okay, so it's a very, very simple process. So to bring it back to the very, very basic simplicity, that's all you really need to do. 
go into Prime, go to your training, and then go through your tools. Kev, do you want to take over for a second? Sure do. All right, so let me hop back in the chat and see what questions we got. John, I can check into that for you for sure. Definitely, definitely. You're welcome, John. If you already have a ticket, and if you already have a ticket to the online event, to the event, and you would like to keep that and use that towards the online event, then do nothing, and we got you covered. If you would like to not participate in the online event, then you can just hit up our customer support, and they'll take care of you. Definitely, Derek, and we can cover um, we can cover more of that on next week's webinar as well. So make sure you're there for sure. Yeah, beautiful. Uh, that's a great question. Yes, the to the cost of the event will be the exact the, the same. It'll be the VIP, the same cost of the VIP tickets that we had out there just a couple days ago. Okay, let me see if we got any more questions. Let's um, the, the deadline, that's a great question, Trudy. The deadline for getting the ticket is right up until that day. Right? There'll be no real deadline. And you could purchase it later on as well and get the recording if you want to. It's up to you. And for those of you, um, I got a couple questions from the DS domination side as well. This is there's something I want to really go over with you or, or at least bring to your attention. What you're going to start seeing, and you, you already got invited to this last week, um, and you'll be perpetually invited to it, is the Saturday trainings that we do on e-commerce. So for those of you that, uh, you know, make sure you get on those Saturday morning trainings. Every Saturday morning we have a training, and it's designed to kind of get you up and running, get you started, move into some more advanced material every Saturday like clockwork and you guys can find those recordings in your back office as well. So make sure you're attending those. Who's been on those and, and checking those out and going through those? Yes, Paul says they're very good training. Are you guys enjoying those? Yeah, right? Definitely, definitely. Yeah. So this is um this is something that we're doing. And if you're in DS domination, you've been invited as well. You have an email. And we'll actually put a link to that inside of DSD. So we, we just want to make sure you guys have more ongoing training. And we do these every single week. Yep. And you're right, Norman. Always something new on those. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. It's 11, uh, 11 CST, I believe, which is right at midnight. It's it's my, <laughs> I'm not usually on those because it's late in the evening for me. It's like uh, two in the morning for me. So, And we'll actually start taking those. I'll tell you what, for the DS domination, I see a couple more DS domination questions in here. We'll actually take those and put them in, in the DSD back office for you guys if you like. Beautiful, beautiful. All right, so if we have any more questions, let me know. If not, we'll wrap this up and we'll kick you guys out an email of the recording so you can rewatch this. And we'll invite you to another webinar next week where we'll go through more about the event kind of date that we're really doing there. All right, I guess that's it. So I appreciate you guys for being here. Hopefully some of these updates will really help you out. I know, um, I know that, uh, you know, they were much needed out there in, in, in what we're doing. Keep your eye on your email inbox. we got more updates coming up for you tomorrow. Um, we're, you're going to start seeing a lot more of us on that side of the house because we have a lot of people that are doing amazing things. We just want to highlight what they're doing. I mean, you saw it yourself, 17.5 million on our listing uh, creation software and our tracking tools. 
beautiful stuff. You guys are rocking out. You guys are awesome. We love what you're doing. We appreciate you, and we'll see you guys on the next webinar.